Ladies and gentlemen, what's going on? Once again, I'm Ned from Nav's Tech, but otherwise known as your friendly neighborhood basement dweller. Don't worry, ma'am, I am from the internet. Today, I want to be checking out this Lenovo ThinkStation P360. is a tiny version. We have an 8 gigabyte card here. Uh, NVIDIA T1000 and uh, i7 up here. So I got this because we needed to do some CAD, but the CAD just didn't work out because of the Windows 11. Windows 11 is just no freaking good. I gotta tell you, Windows 11, is no freaking good right now later on it might be wonderful but right now it is just the worst thing ever upon further inspection i'm not i'm legitimately not sure if i have ever seen an i7 uh with that little megahertz so i tried some stable diffusion on here it just would not load now i'm used to getting errors that say that uh, we don't have enough memory but this error is definitely quite different because it looks like the gpu just isn't fast enough now this is both parts interesting and depressing because you'd think that the t1000 would have uh, better power than the p2000 because the p was last generation I can get Stable Diffusion working on a P2000, but not a T1000. What the heck is up with that? It does, however, run Olama very efficiently. Oh, I need a coffee, 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 coffee. Tea's fine too, I'll do tea, that's not a problem. Alright, and then it shows me stuff like this, running at 105 frames per second. This seems like it should be running Stable Diffusion just fine. Hmm, and again... I really haven't got Stable Diffusion running on anything other than my Titan X card, so maybe I'm asking for a little too much. But then again, I could get this running with the P2000 on Stable Diffusion. Why not the P1000? 55 frames per second in DirectX 10. DirectX 11 at 25 frames per second. 66 frames, looking really good with that jellyfish, space jellyfish. Now DirectX 12 is legitimately looking very, very nice. I don't see why this thing couldn't use stable diffusion. That's, that's going to get me. I got to find out why won't this card do stable diffusion. But this predecessor could. Let's find out. Cause this is looking good. All right, that is insanely powerful. I just don't know why it is that it couldn't do the computational powers that other systems can. Probably just has something to do with the size. <laughs> Anyways, folks, that's it from me. Have a good one.